the security over internet is improving every day. But the number of hackers and hacking cases are skyrocketing too. Even in my previous video, I just showed that how a hacker hacks your password. So in today's video, I'm gonna tell you that how you can completely secure your account by setting a damned powerful password. And also a few other tips by which you can really make your account an anti-hack account. So with that being said, your WhatsApp guys have been shared and now without wasting any time, let's get started. In my previous video, I showed the ways and methods by which a hacker cracks your password. So this is obvious that the password is the main thing by which you can maximize your account's security. So, most of the people set passwords on the name of their boyfriend, girlfriend, sometimes the name of their pet, mobile number, mother's or father's name, and something which is somehow related to the personal stuff and information. And these kind of things can be easily guessed by any password guesser so easily by just using a dictionary attack. So now I hope you all have understood that setting a strong password is something very important to protect your account from the hackers, from brute force and dictionary attacks. Now for setting a very strong password, the things I will suggest are, the first thing you have to take the text part related to the thing which is something very unique and which is not having anything such as personal information. For example, your unique things can be any accessories name, brand name, object name or anything which is something unique and uncommon. Now. The main thing which really matters, which really makes your password a strong password are the digits and combination quality. Using numbers, symbols and upper lower combinations is very important these days. Using a simple text password can be easily cracked by a brute force attack within hours or within minutes. So for example, I am taking this password for instance, which is 08 hash leather jacket by Zara and again hash 08. This password seems to be complex, but it's actually not. It's damn easy to remember and cracking passwords like these will take trillion of years for brute force attack and dictionary attacks, which is actually not possible and this is just a hypothetical case. Even a password guesser cannot guess a password like these because this is a god kind of thing because this is something very uncommon to guess and also you are using alphabets and numericals. Like in this password, I use numbers 08, then a symbol hash. Then an uncommon text which is leather jacket by Zara, in which leather jacket is written in lowercase and Zara is written in uppercase. And then again hash 08 which is to make the password little symmetrical. So it will become easy to remember. Also this password is having 4 numbers, 2 symbols, 14 lowercase and 4 uppercase letters. And hence brute force attack will take trillion of years cracking this password which is highly impossible and hypothetical. Also by this, your password is of 24 digits, easy to remember and prone to dictionary attacks and brute force attacks. In a survey, it has been detected that most of the Indians use very common passwords like I love you, I love my country, 12345678, sunshine, qwerty, qwerty123 and these kind of passwords are easily available on a dictionary word list and they can be cracked within minutes or even in few seconds. Now, apart from the password, there is an additional security which can be added onto your account. That is known as two steps verification and it is also known as two factors authentication. A lot of you guys may know about it, but still for those who don't use this or who don't really know about it, they should really implement two factors authentication onto their account. Because by this, even if you will log in using a password, you will have to enter the one time password which will be sent to your mobile number or onto your email address. So guys, these were all about just making a very strong password and to make your account an anti-hack account. There are very simple things you have to do. The first thing you have to do is to set a secure password by using the combination of alpha, numerical and symbols. Apart from that, the second thing you have to do is to implement and to turn on the two factors authentication onto your account. And that's all. So I hope that you all have enjoyed this video a lot and guys if you have any question in your mind regarding this video please put a comment below in the comment section and also give this video a thumbs up and do subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on tech. I am Devyan Sharon and I'll catch you in the next one.